Chongqing is gearing up towards a large political event called the Chongqing Two Sessions, or as it's known in Chinese, Chongqing Lianghui. The Two Sessions is a key annual gathering of the Chongqing Municipal People's Congress, the NPC Chongqing, and the Chongqing Municipal Committee of the Chinese People's Political Consultative Conference, the CPPCC Chongqing. The Chongqing Two Sessions is being held from January 20th to January 25th, ahead of the National Two Sessions in Beijing in March. But what is the Chongqing Two Sessions, and why is it considered a key event? Well, to answer that, let us take a closer look at the Chongqing Two Sessions starting these days. The Chongqing Two Sessions is a meeting of Chongqing's top legislative and political advisory body. These will reconvene in Beijing during the National Two Sessions once Chongqing and all the provinces, municipalities, and autonomous regions have had their own local Two Sessions. These local Two Sessions meetings are a way for the local government to present their plans for their respective areas, while the National Two Sessions will outline plans for all of China. The meeting of the CPPCC Chongqing starts first. As Chongqing's top political advisory body, the 845 members come from different political parties, social groups, professions, and organizations. During their conference, the members discuss issues like the economy, healthcare, and other affairs related to the city of Chongqing. Members of the CPPCC Chongqing can submit proposals for the government to improve the lives of Chongqing's more than 30 million residents. This is also why the CPPCC Chongqing is made up of people from all walks of life and all kinds of professions, as this is the way for the people to be involved. But the CPPCC does not have the power to make laws. That power lies with the NPC, the National People's Congress. The National People's Congress in Chongqing has 860 deputies, and the NPC is the highest organ of state power in China, responsible for putting forward motions for new laws and amendments. According to the Constitution of the People's Republic of China, all state power belongs to the people. The National People's Congress, the NPC, and the local People's Congresses at various levels are the bodies through which the people exercise state power. One of the highlights of the Chongqing Two Sessions is to examine and approve the government work report. The report will be delivered by the mayor detailing Chongqing's economical and development progress in 2020, as well as plans for the year 2021. This report is important because it gives a clear picture of how Chongqing is performing overall and it outlines the focus of the government going forward. This year will also see the review and approval of the 14th Five-Year Plan for National Economic and Social Development and Long-Term Objectives through the year 2035.